way back into La Rochelle. It's a massive, massive yacht club here. Can't even count the masts. Masts. They're all coming out from the yacht club one by one. There's a lot of people sailing today. whole line of people going out to sea. around the corner there. Looks like it looks about the best beach around. Here we go, the three towers. The Tech Lower Shell. Two of them together, one of them like a fairy tower. Towers are part of the wall of the of the city went all the way around, like many cities were fortified. So there is some of the wall still remaining. And the towers are left to the fortifications. Well worth going into. Some of the graffiti in there is amazing. Just gone deep into the brick and drawn ships and and their names and the ships they were from and the years and then some of them are the 1700s and some. This 
looks like a um, little, little place to moor motorboats. Really, they're all, or nearly, um, or a lot of them are really just motors. chance maybe this evening to walk you along that bridge. It's a great place to run as well. ferry from where we're gonna from where we're docking just to the other side of the bridge it's very cute it's only about a euro you just go it gets you to the other side without having to walk around what a beautiful town not such a beautiful day bit of a cloud in the air, a few clouds, but I think it's going to cheer up a bit later in the afternoon. See the French tricolour, tricolour flying high on that tower. You can see some of the fortified wall. South here, going off to that tower. So you can walk across, you can walk along that wall. It, it's quite narrow, but the houses, the there's beautiful houses alongside there as well. It looks like we're going through the through the expense so this is sort of the centre of town this is more or less where my boat is Centre de Ville. Oh, my 
about is in the next stop. So. My boat's over there in the next little base, the next yacht base over there. Some quite cool graffiti over there. And you get some, you get the men playing bowls in front of that building with the graffiti. And this is the old lighthouse. It, it lines up to that lighthouse, if you can see that lighthouse and this lighthouse. They were lines, and they're still used today, as you can see the light coming out of that. Sure, they're turning around here. Very good, eh? Let's see what it looks like from the back. The canal goes all the way up that road. I haven't been up there yet. It's sort of been a little bit of a way up there. I really haven't really walked around the well I've walked around a little bit. It's a beautiful town with lovely arched shopping centres or shops underneath centuries old arches see that's the that's the entrance to the city under that arch there there's a lovely statue there in front of it and you go through that entrance to the city you walk under these colonnaded arches too and this have got a, a really medieval feel about it I don't think there's an old city or a new city here it's just, it looks like it's just an old city. And there's, there's not a lot of these are seafood restaurants. You get the seafood fish. This is the other catamaran, the, the, the sister of the one that we're on, it's the same name, Capalquist. Capal, Capalquist. So this is the other one, they're doing the same trip this morning. at the top there. That's where I was yesterday. Docks. Docks there. It just goes across 
just goes across the river. And I think we're going to our docking place now. on the dock of the bay. for watching.